Let's talk. I almost made a terrible mistake, blinded by revenge. The kid is right. Without the Iron Heart, nothing would bring any comfort to the souls of my old colleagues. But if we can find it and use it, that'd make me happy for both my old colleagues and my current teammates. Luna, she's not so bad. But I'll tell her that in person later, so pretend like you didn't hear this. Especially you, Guy. And you too. As you wish. Now we should get to our respective positions. I want you to help Reyna while I go see Marcus. Everything okay? Looked like there was a bit of commotion or something. Anyway, I think we found something. My excavation equipment and Luna's sonic survey both seem to indicate that... Oh... Something feels off about this place. I'll send you the coordinates, Descendant. Hurry, I need your help. our hero come to seek answers for, I wonder. We found something strange when we were looking for traces of the ancient RK weapon. The bones of a giant creature. Given the size of the bones, it must have been as big as Corel's flagship. We've never seen anything like this before. I ran a search on the Albion database, and it came up with a match for an animal called the Caligo. Carbon dating results suggest that this Caligo is from the same era as the ruins of the ancestors. That makes it the oldest organism ever discovered in Albion. 
Same thing with this. Carbon dating shows from the same period as the ruins of the ancestors that are around here. The excavation team and I think that these bones are somehow closely related to the RK weapon. And they both existed in the same era as the ancestors. Maybe that means something? Maybe the ancestors used them for an experiment or something? I'm sure we can come up with several plausible hypotheses. I think we should also notify your... guy, is it? I'll contact HQ and have them send the info to your receive. The Caligal may be from the same era as the Ancestors, but I think they must have died out before I was created, as there is no information on them in my database. Or, access to the information may have been secretly blocked. There's so much I don't know yet. I wish we could find data that I don't know or don't have access to. Then I may understand the real reason for my existence.
this who started this horrible party. You should take care of them. Still noisy. You gotta keep moving if you're gonna ruin someone else's party. Hold your ground. Party's almost over. 
Volgus went that way. Be careful. storing Caligo bones. Now I have to try to figure out why. This amplification radar can boost the accuracy of the amplification equipment. And even me. So don't mess it up.
here to ruin our operation. Take care of it. We got some pretty clear data from the radar. I think we can find where the Caligo is buried with this. Thank you. <laughs> Found it, finally. Hurry, get the guide and come here. All right, Luna. But before we go, there's something I want to share. sample we took from the Caligo. A small amount of RK has been detected on it. It's strange. Ancestors aside, how can RK be detected on the bone of some giant organism I have never heard of? I cannot be sure, but there's a good chance that the ancestors used the Caligo to test the RK weapon. Based on the data on the Caligo that we received through the Isive, if we estimate its original size based on the size of the bone, its bone density and composition, and assume appropriate muscle mass to support this, its body would be comparable in toughness to that of a colossus. A caligo like that would have been the perfect subject to test a weapon of such immense power. This is only a hypothesis, but it is the only conclusion that I can find when applying the calculations. We will need additional data in order to replace or confirm this. Guide, I understand that we have to move quickly. But I'm sorry, I can't. I'm feeling dizzy from all those sounds I was exposed to. Oh, everything sounds like noise to me now. I don't think I'll be able to handle a cave or somewhere where everything echoes. Luna, return to Albion now. I'll take care of things here. Uh, hello? I believe your thrusters have overheated. If you can't fly, you know you're about as useful as an empty tin can. You should have a nice fix you up before you break completely. <sighs> you're right. My thrusters as well as my suit are at their limits. Guide, look after the kid. Luna and I will head back. All right, Kyle. Please take care of Luna. We'll investigate here. on this animal? I wonder if this is why they created a weapon using RK and tested its power. We've delved this far into the past. Time to discover an ancient secret. I know the Vulgus are also desperately investigating this place because RK can be detected here. <laughs>
only to me. I don't know why this is, but we should focus on the operation for now. The RK weapon is hidden beneath the Mirage Stone. As I can move the weapon, let's join forces with HQ and carry out the operation together.
If it's new research, I'm listening. Secured the airspace above the operation zone. I'll leave you to handle the interior. Enzo has minimized external interference. We should be able to better focus on our objectives. We need to determine what the bodies are doing inside the cave. We need to know why the items that Jeremy is pursuing are inside, as well as what they are. As Jeremy is not with me, there is no way for me to know what he is planning. We must stop him before it is too late. Esma warned us that the Vulgus here are stronger. Please be careful. mentioned in Alzarok's autopsy report. What? So, what you're saying is... Jeremy took it. There are no access records on this terminal for anything else like the boss. That is all I can say. We must explore to her. I will focus on detecting process from the outside. Seems the Vulgus have established a large-scale Kaibo refinery here. Concealed from the vigilant eyes of Albion. Just the idea that Alzarok exists is proof enough for me that we can't allow this to continue. We will finalize the detonation of the facility, or you will eliminate the enemy forces. Powerful enemy units have been deployed to protect the Kyber. Please be on your guard. <laughs> Based on data analysis, the high-density Kuiper produced in this cave was used to enhance the Vulgus who occupied this zone. The Vulgus made a lot of effort to enhance their forces. I admit it, Esimo was right to follow his nose. The question is, 
Why does Jeremy want this? The substance cannot be used by humans. There are no signs of Jeremy here either. It may be because of the contamination. No. The density of the Kuiper is too low for that. Jeremy was after high density Kuiper and didn't touch any of this. Check the total amount of Kuiper within the facility. Albion suddenly interested in the Kuiper hybrid bomb. There is a larger Kuiper deposit on the other side of the facility. But you should focus on eliminating the enemy first. Alzarok-level focus for centuries. It probably contains a high level of contamination. What? Okay, everybody get out. I'm going to blow it to hell right now. SMO, don't blow it up yet. Jeremy might still be inside. Enzo is correct. We have not found any evidence of Jeremy at any of the other Kuiper deposits so far. There may be signs of him on the other side of the facility. Right. Jeremy will probably be after the Kuiper with the highest density. I'm so pleased that you came all this way in person, descendants. I'm curious about the effectiveness of the enhancements to my forces. Would you be so kind as to test them for me? Bob's commander seems to be saying we're the first to arrive. Descendant, we must secure this area before Jeremy can. Location, there will be no suitable zone for Jeremy to obtain high density Kuiper from. Should he look for Kuiper in an outside source, he will not be able to avoid being detected by us. <laughs> Are you? The Vulgus can't see me. Why? Because I exist in their blind spot. The Vulgus can't see me. Why? Are you? Oh, my beloved daughter, Daya. Let me tell you. Let me tell you how I managed to come. Thank you. 
Decay descendants. The reason the excavation team couldn't reach here is because the Volga started digging here first. Anais told me that they brought the Magisters here, the ones who didn't escape, and forced them to work. That's why this place is called the Asylum. According to Anais, the Magisters who were brought here for forced labor might have found some information, but they couldn't have solved the code. Actually, they probably pretended not to know the code. She said that we have to hurry up with the search anyway. The vault is clearly increased their efficiency, especially since operations in the sterile land. Get the down! Need to be recharged! Given the reaction of the commander we encountered recently, I must not have considered the possibility that we would appear so soon. We must be time to be recharged. We must be attempting to extract all of the ancestors of our data at once. The enemy has an encrypted communications device. If you defeat them, I can access its memory and communication history data. I have analyzed the data we obtained from the enemy. The most frequently mentioned words are Sewer, Red Sphere Shell Component, and Conflict. I have assessed the shell analysis data. The shell is composed of a similar material to the links surrounding the Iron Heart. Combining all of the data, I believe we can conclude that the ancestors inserted the Iron Heart into the Red Sphere. This is connected to the civil war that broke out in Vesper. Perhaps the ancestors threw the Iron Heart inside the Red Sphere because they felt that some of them couldn't hold it. I cannot figure out the exact steps they took, but the important thing is that the sealing was successful. Yes, keep struggling! There's nothing you can do! The Fulgus Legion is the Apex Predator! I'm analyzing the data retrieved from the destroyed device. Please buy me some time.
of sound. It's filled with way too much noise, so we're not sure about it, but we're going there anyway. All right, man. We're also trying to gather as much data as possible. Keep up the good work. Security removed. Beginning analysis. The data contains records of the ancestors who tried to remove the Ironheart, their operation plans, and the blueprint for the special weapon to break the seal. The weapon's power source was...
sensitivity of my bandwidth. Damn it. The enemy are swarming on this side, too. I won't let a single bastard through, but you'll have to take care of whatever's inside. Jeremy, the Ironheart, and the soldiers. None of their fates are certain. Don't look back, Descendant. Keep moving forward. Now that Corral has arrived in person, the Vulgas are fully prepared. Unless we destroy their alarm, we will continue to alert more enemy troops. It will endanger not only us, but Enzo and Esimo as well. to extract the signal. Go. Oh, the signal has been interrupted. Disrupted by something. Jeremy may have placed the Iron Heart back into the quantum storage box.
one of the descendants. You are mine. Lord Karenu's orders were to... Take care of any descendants who have followed. Descendants? Only one more left. I can detect traces of Germany on my focus. We may be able to find out what happened here. Magisters are probably humanity's real home, don't you think? <laughs> 